what is up? So wanted to go over the entirety of this uh, Donda double layer hoodie saga shenanigans. So I ordered it on August the 14th and you know, it was one of those very limited releases where you, I, 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 I believe I had five minutes to even grab this thing, put it in my cart and uh, check out. And that was, um, it was one of the 6 p.m. releases. So it was at 6.01 exactly when it loaded up and I had checked out before, you know, I could even blink basically. And yeah, I ended up getting a um, purchase confirmation for it and everything. And, you know, later on it shipped, it, it shipped, it got delivered on August the 23rd. Um, so it only took about, it took about a week and a couple days to get to my door. So, um, yeah, the, the, the thing gets to my door and, um, that's not a Donda double air hoodie. <laughs> and I, I, I remember it because, um, it was supposed to go to my house, the house that y'all are currently looking at right now. And, um, but apparently when I was checking out through Apple pay or in, in the shop app, it had my old address, which was my parents' address in my system somewhere. And I don't know if it was Apple Pay or if it was Shop App, but it had my, had my old parents' address. I, I emailed them asking, hey, can you change it to my new address? And they were like, yeah, no problem. So they changed it to my new address within the day. And it, you know, it looked like it, it had updated on the, um, on the order. When you click on the view order thing, it looked like it updated on there and everything. And this was before it shipped. It was a couple of days before it shipped. It, it ships out, it ends up at my parents' house anyway, and it's the wrong item. So I'm just like, ah, oh, great, man. What do I do now? So I, what I do? I um, email them. I just email uh, support at Los Angeles Archive or whatever within five minutes. We appreciate your patience. To better assist, can you please provide us with your order number? Give my order number. And a couple minutes later, I had a, well, no, I, I believe right as they sent me this, um, I, I don't know why, but I think a separate thread was started where they actually gave me maybe some kind of system uh, email where they actually gave me the return receipt. So I got the return receipt or the return, um, the return labeling. I uh, taped that thing right on that package and drove my butt straight to USPS to return it. And uh, yeah, return it to USPS, and you, you can probably see the whole process. I don't even know why I'm even talking about it. But yep, got everything to USPS. It took it about um, it took it about five days to get back to Los Angeles, and then I would say about a day to get the email that you are seeing right now, which is, hey, you received a refund. You got your 116 bucks back. So. Yeah, and, and you know, they, they, they said in one of the replies that, yeah, we can see if we can do the, um, the refund or the replacement. I already knew there was no way in heck I was getting a replacement. This is a, apparently a very rare hoodie that goes for a lot of money. And th what sucks about it is that I wouldn't have even, I wouldn't have even um, resold it. I would have actually worn that thing. So I, I was super upset if you want to see that first video. But and yeah, that first video exists, but I just wanted to make this to show you all the entirety of the process behind, you know, returning stuff through Los Angeles Archive if you get the wrong item. Uh, whether or not you just want to return it willy-nilly, I think I tried to return this thing saying that, hey, I think I just got the wrong size. This thing is super oversized. And they were like, nah, we can't really do anything about that. So, but it seems like in the case of getting the wrong item, you have a better chance of actually, you know, returning stuff and getting your money back or, if you're mega lucky getting a replacement or something like that, but uh, highly doubt that's going to happen for anything that's not part of the mainline stuff. So, but anyway, just wanted to make this quick update to show y'all, you know, just how that process went. Uh, I got something arriving tomorrow that I will do a unboxing of. So I look forward to that. But anyway, thanks for watching as always and more soon.